Hey guys, today I'm going to make Gizmo Duck. So let's start. For the torso, get a 2x3 drawer piece and put two of these 2x3 curved pieces here and here. Put a 1x2 here and put a jumper plate. Put a 1x2 here. Put a jumper plate right here. For the head, get an Erling brick and put a Travis brick on top of it. Here, get this 1x2 plate that is half cheese slope. Put two jumper plates like this and like this. And put two more on the sides. Get this one by two with three teeth sticking out of it and attach it right here. And put a one by one plate right here. Put a cheese slope here. And the final piece, which is a one by two tile that is transparent blue. Now attach the head right here. For the arms, get two two by two round pieces. Stack these on top of each other and stack up three black studs. Place these in between here. Get a headlight brick and put a cheese slope here. That's the hand and the thumb. Now get the thing that we're making and attach these arms in here. Now to make the wheel. First, get a 1x2 plate and a 1x1 one one plate with two studs coming out of it. Put a jumper plate and a 1x1 one one tile. Now, get a 1x1 one one brick with a hole in it. Put a gray peg, these are the loose ones, and put a wheel. Put a one by one here and stack up two one by ones here. Put two studs on top of each assembly and attach these here and over here. Now to put the wheel on. Gizmo Duck is finished, but how is he going to stand up? Well, just as the Quake Mech, there's going to be a cheater stand. So get a 1x6 plate, get a jumper plate, get a 1x2 brick that has a slope here. Now get a 1x2 brick that has a slope in it. Attach it here. Put a stud here and put another 1x2 brick that has a slope on it, this time at the top. Now attach this onto here and angle this. Now let's take a good look at it. Well, thanks for watching guys. I hope you liked it. Please feel free to subscribe. Bye!